album. Yes. Are you a fan of uh, David Bowie, um, Arctic Monkeys frontman Alex? Certainly am, Jonathan. Mm, of course you are. <laughs> um, I always think that there are heavy influences in your music, and of course you write it, from British rock in particular, it seems to me. It seems to me like you are you, you love that kind of stuff. What uh, have you been listening to at the moment? Who has been the influence, if there is one primary or a number of sources, for the new Arctic Monkeys album? I'm um, sorry, I was just distra- distracted by your miniature eggs there. <laughs> I yeah. should point out that we're not talking about something <coughs> saucy here. No. I do have four <laughs> mini cabbage cream eggs on the, yeah. the desk in front of me, being given to me kindly by Fiona, the producer, who felt my sugar levels were either getting too low or too yeah. high. Boost. Either wanted to boost me or finish me off. Yeah. I'm not sure. Yeah. Would you care for one? Maybe as a little reward if I do well. Well, in that case, mm. the answer will probably be no, because <laughs> if I have to give one of these up, yeah. and there's a chance I don't have to, I'm going to keep them all. I'll yeah. give you one now. I'll okay. roll it down for you. That's an egg going down the desk now <laughs> towards Alex. It's nice, nicely positioned as well. Yeah, that's good. That's just within reach. Yeah. And when you finish the song, we'll both lunge. All right? <laughs> yeah. and it's actually nearer you, Alex. I think you've got yeah. more of a chance. You're a younger man. You're probably a faster man, but you're slowed down by that guitar. I am, yeah. <laughs> no. uh, who are you listening to for Humbug, the new album? Any who particular references? Or? Um, yeah, I mean, I suppose it's like a, a, you know, a year or so ago now, but I remember at that time we'd, we'd sort of... We dug a bit of Hendrix out again. Oh, yes. Went back to that. For Have you listened to that new album? They've, they've yeah, yeah, it's yeah. pretty good, isn't it? Mm. It's good. I yeah. like the sunshine of your love. He does on there, of oh, course. But that's the, a great thing. Ding, ding, yeah. ding, 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 ding. Were you a Cream fan? Yeah. We, in fact, like Israeli Gears and that, we were playing as well a little bit on this. Do you listen to the slightly uh, less well-known bands or the late appear that they mutate into? For example, Humble Pie, Uriah Heap, those kind of bands. And well, there's the one. The, the one I think of in the same breath as Queen is the Blind Faith. Oh, Blind Faith, yeah, which yeah, yeah. The, I really like that tune of theirs. Which, which was that, like, Ginger Baker and yeah. Winwood was in there, wasn't it? It was kind of a super group, but it was a kind of albums-only super mm. group, wasn't it? Which, and uh, that, that tune, Do What You Like, I really like it. I, I'm not, I wasn't sort of massively into that, but that one tune's like a... Now, have you immersed yeah, yourself in this, like, uh, do you deliberately say, OK, I'm going to listen to these bands because I've heard of them, I'm going to give them a chance, or are there certain radio stations you listen to that, that you pick it up from? I don't know, I think sort of one... One thing leads to another, really. It's like you you find one thing and that kind of leads to another ten or, or someone turns you on to something and then, it, yeah, you the, know. The faces? Yeah, th- not, not like sort of had a, had a big delve into the face. Wings? <laughs> you're just going to list <laughs> it. I'm curious, were you butt out? Less so. <laughs> wings? No wings? No wings. Who else are you going to think? You're going to think of someone else. Yeah. else. Would you please <laughs> give me a, ch- a chance here? You're trying to think of something. Well, yeah, uh, give, I'm just about to say it. <laughs> Baccarat. Baccarat? Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm. No, not Burr Baccarat. <laughs> Baccarat, yes, so I can boogie. Oh, no, I don't know. <laughs> That's Baccarat. OK, close enough. <laughs> you put me off with your big face and your interruption. I'm confused. <laughs> I don't quite have to work with that, Alex. <laughs> no, not Burr, you didn't mean that. No, no. But I do love Burr Baccarat. Yeah. Um, uh, I wonder how uh, you got from wings to Burt Bacharach. You know? I didn't really. But I like <laughs> a bit of wings. Do you not like a bit of wings? Oh, yeah, I actually saw McCartney before Christmas down at the O2. Yeah, great, well, so what? Well, we can all go and see him live. <laughs> <laughs> uh, listen. No, he was just down at the O2. He Red Rose, there, Red we Rose Speedway. Red Rose Speedway is an album I like a lot, and I have to like a lot to even attempt pronouncing it. <laughs> so I would urge you to seek that one out. Okay. He doesn't look that interested in it, I don't think. Well, you've put him off with interruptions, <laughs> that's what it is. We were getting on great. <laughs> what, when you were swapping about an egg? Swapping band names and sharing eggs, and then you come eggs. in with... You're just listing bands. Blustering in like a big pirate. <laughs> he looks like something out of Captain Pugwash over there. <laughs> uh, Alex, how are you getting on with the next album? Are you working on new material now already? You must have, because I, I get the feeling you're someone who keeps writing. Yeah, definitely. We, um, we've just got one more tour on the Humbug, and then... I think we're gonna gonna leap into it. Have you uh, considered a concept album? You are, you've asked me this before, I actually. Because I can yeah, see yeah. you do. Because this because I think of you as being part of that history of rock in that way, mm. which I think I hope you think is That's a nice flattering, thing. Yeah. No, but I genuinely think you have that talent. It's you're flattering about... that you think we're equipped to well, uh, produce. I, 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 I long for a concept album these yeah. days. <laughs> you never see him anymore. Because when we dressed up in all the the clown <gasps> gear, you were like, "Do you think there's any chance of a uh... clown based album?" <laughs> <laughs> when I heard this no, record Humbug, I was thinking, them, like... please let it be about sweet shops. <laughs> <laughs> There's a chance, isn't there? Like Ogden's Nut Gone Flake. 
yes. Yeah. You know, could have been. So, but that's not... That's Maybe, not... I, yeah, I don't know. I have to think of a concept, I suppose. OK, uh, what, do you know what song you played before? Uh, we're going to play a track now, just yep. to give you a chance to uh, okay. get the sound of it. But what track are you going to play? Is it one from the album? It's going to be um, the B-side to my propeller, actually. It's called Joining the Dot. Oh, well, that's not on here. No, no, think. that's just... It's, it's going to be on the single of My Propeller. Well, My Propeller is, so. is a true... But I thought they'd already been released, because I'd heard that quite a lot on the radio. Is that the one people have just been I, picking out the I album? believe, yeah, like, yeah. It, maybe it's this week or next. Well, yeah. My Propeller's a great track. I'm looking forward to hearing the, uh, the B-side of it. First of all, we're going to play something else, and then afterwards it will be um, Alex playing live. I'm telling you what, I approve of that one. That's Captain Williams' uh, track from her album, The Quickening. The, the track's called Just a Feeling. Well, he's played some terminal rubbish today. <laughs> I'm not just saying yeah. it to be oh, contentious. that's very nice, isn't it? Well, you have played some not, not bad stuff, but stuff that, you know what I mean, you, you, you don't, wouldn't care if you didn't hear it again. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, you know the kind of thing. Oh, you're in it. you've got it in for me, haven't you? We've got two oh, weeks why away. Why is it? Don't it's take all right, it personally. I'll, you know, I'll be all right in a couple of weeks. Don't take it personally, yeah. please. Alex Turner is with us, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, he is the main man of the Arctic Monkeys. He's about to uh, play the B-side. A radical choice. The B-side. The cheek. <laughs> the cheek. Of it. Oh, the ego of this bloke. He comes in here, we're saying, just give us here, will you? Give us that one about the dance floor. No. <laughs> 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 um, uh, the B-side of My Propeller, which is a fabulous track. It's the third single from the new album. Humbug. Not a concept album, despite what you might think. Um, <laughs> uh, but it's a great track, My Propeller. And this is now, is it called Join the Dots? Joining the Dots. Joining yeah. the Dots. Here you are. This is just for you, live on Radio 2. Alex, take it away. I'm trying to think of something colourful For the season For the world I'm joining the dark I thought I heard them talking in their sleep Yesterday And I tried but I just can't believe A word they say Hurry up they'll be here soon Sleeping in the afternoon while the rain is trying to prove a point outside from the smoke in your hair to the blood in your bruise and the bows on the shoes you kicked off. I'm joining the dark. I'm joining the dark. That's a great sound. Yeah. Great song. And well done to Nick out there. who's not much to look at, but he did a good job of uh, uh, getting the sound. It sounded yeah. great. It sounded like a proper record and everything. Really? <laughs> Ready to go. But you know what I mean? Are you having your egg? Worth an egg? Go on, have your egg. Go no. on. Go on. <laughs> Crack it open. Finally. <laughs> now, now, and we will report back on exactly... Uh, this is one of those... I'm not going to name the company, but it's one of those cream-based eggs. <laughs> I have one here. Andy, you're not... I don't, I'm not a big fan. Take, He's a like, teetotal like when it comes to it. I for Ron. What do you mean save it? Uh, what do you mean save it? You know. Uh, yeah, no. 
Yeah, no, I know what's happened if you take that. You will regift it. You'll okay. give it to someone else. Okay. No, no. I don't know what you like. I mean, I'm not suspicious. I'm sure everything's <laughs> above board. Oh, listen to that line. We try and poison you, sunshine. <laughs> We've had them all in here, you know. With a... Hey? <laughs> Never mind some whip I'd snap with one album under his belt. <laughs> Come on here, thinking you're all okay. that. I think I'm going to try and poison you. One of my special poison Play eggs. Poison B-side. <laughs> Look at that. Go, just don't talk with your mouth full. <laughs> mm. That's good, though, isn't it? Mm. Are we going to get Katie Brand in? No, no, just enjoy the moment. Don't what? rush it away. Well, listening to you. I've told you egg. before. I've told you before. Every day, give yourself a little present. <laughs> How'd you eat yours? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, great to see you again. Nice to see you. Good luck guys. with the tour. Thank Good you, luck Alex. with the forthcoming concept album. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> based we'll on the on confectioners one. and sweet shops <laughs> of the British Isles. Yeah. Great to see you. Sell out the rest of the band for me. Will do, Sam. And of course, please tell Alexa to stop calling.